Testing, testing. Street Fighter Six. Cool. You guys can hear me. Hello, guys. This is Mystic Beast back again with Street Fighter Six. I know it's been a while. Um, but I'm gonna jump right into it. The title of the stream is called Finding a Secret Code, because that's what we're doing. We're finding a code. We're gonna be doing a lot of, unfortunately, pointless fights. We got my karate gi now. Now that, uh... You know, because I do consider myself a karateka. Student practitioner of the martial arts. Uh, if you guys haven't already um, checked out Lunatics Landing, the website, the Discord, or our Teespring store, the links are in the About Me section of my Twitch channel. And... Without further ado, let me see where I can go. That's 25. I'm literally making it for time. I do not want to go to the world map. I just want to get out of here. Because, okay, so if I go to missions, and I go tracking the mystery code, post it all across town, follow Linfei's direction to traverse, only seem to appear at certain times of the day. That is... Okay. Well, let me go ahead and move up closer because Desyncing again. Oh, boy, boy. Nope, that's not what I meant. gonna go the opposite direction canary crate sister I don't want any trouble lady okay finally back to safeness So, now that we're back in the subway and we can finally kind of think straight, let me go to 
I don't want to go to items. Okay, that's status. First and foremost, let's check masters for a second. Alright, we can get more conversations. New interactions available with Luke. And then, how am I checking phone? Well, that is my phone. I'm trying to check messages. That's what I want. Street corner messages. Okay, so that one's at night. And we want the other two during the day. We want the other two during the day. So we have to go back. I'm thinking we have to go back. But if we are going back... I am going to have... That's a damage boost. I am going to have a drink. Excuse me? Sir? Sir? I can't let you skate by having that name. There you go. Yeah, it's just not appropriate at all. I'm just curious. I'm probably going to get my ass kicked, but I'm just curious. Twenty seven, yeah, that's what I was afraid of. I feel like those are anime characters, like from different shows. Twenty seven, level fucking twenty seven. There you go. Got him. If I can just get the 30. Finally, we gotta level up. Here you are. 
Got him. Alright, if you're not gonna take... Fucking level 29. Jesus Christ. This is literally my territory. I have earned all of this fucking subway space. Golly. Alright. All this effort just to uh, literally change it from day to night. No. No. Doing laps. Change it from from night to day. How you doing, Fred? We should get to interact more with the NPCs besides fighting. But I can see why they uh they wouldn't. Okay, so now I just gotta look. Where am I? I'm probably nowhere near where I need to be. Uh, board Breaker Ben. Style Lab. Luke. Jamie. Max. I'll uh, just keep going down this street. We gotta talk to Luke anyway. Look 
We're going to go inside, talk to Luke. Gotta talk. Think of it. So did you catch all the survival hole martial arts tournament hubbub? Yeah, I saw it live. So you saw me tear it up out there, huh? Sucks that the rest of it was such a downer. The sponsor at the Master Foundation was accused of funding the terrorists behind the string of attacks in Nashal. I saw what was going on behind the scenes, or caught a glimpse of it anyway. To be honest with you, Ken Masters was set up his wealth and fame used to fuel the true masterminds scheme. He lost almost everything before going missing, but there's one thing he didn't lose, his son, Mel. To be honest? I looked after Mel while he was in Nashal, in fact. Keep this to your chest, but we're still in contact. I can't just stand by and watch a father and son get torn apart by terrorism. I'm trying to help them even now. Okay. By the way. You a tinkerer? You know, like buildings, computers, that sort of thing? Customizing PCs is a hobby of mine, believe it or not. That's right. The right combination of components and software can give you a serious performance boost. Just dumping a ton of money into expensive parts is boring. It's all about finding that cost to performance sweet spot. That's how one of my old pals sold me on it back when I was a kid. I polished motorcycle parts in the garage while he told me all kinds of cool stuff about the world. There's nothing more thrilling than firing up a finely tuned machine, and nothing more addicting either. By the way. Of course, the machine I the machines I tune are PCs. If I want to tear up the road on a motorcycle, that's what racing games are for. Okay, cool. Good talking with you, Sensei. Gonna go back outside. So there's Alice. There it is. Day. Alright, so let's look at the photos again. Messages. Ethan. Night. This is daytime. Okay, and I think that's also in the other side of the city. 
So then I somehow need... To go... Where is it? That's the opposite direction. I need to go this way. Tracking the mysterious code. Oh, okay. So there's literally a fucking waypoint. Now that I'm in the daytime. I'm dumb. Map. Let's do some training. All right, check RD five one. A poster that reads RD51. It's unclear who's up, who put it up, and for what purpose. Sometimes it vanishes. It even vanishes. Myster mysteries abound. Are we in the other part of town? Oh, no longer roadblocks. That's cool. I don't think I no longer need to take the subway. Yeah, we're literally... Yay! I no longer need to take the subway. I'm so happy about that. That's 36. That's, that's booty. That's booty. What are you doing? Oh, stop. Ow. Alright. Counter. Um, that was uncalled for. You don't need to call me tiny. There you go. I'm gonna fight my way to that code, like it or not, buddy. Alright. Got him. Come on. This ain't a playground. I'm the strongest. I'm right behind them. I've got this. This ain't a play 
Fuck. God damn it. Fuck. Jesus Christ. ST33. Take down the poster. Items only be used during battle. Huh. I need to hit up food. I need food. Randall, what are you doing up there? I do not care. I, I need I need out. All right. Then I need foods. Where can I get foods? Um that. Top Keeper Udon. Am I headed in the right? Yep, I am headed in the right direction. Don restaurant shopkeeper. Thank you for coming. Oh boy. Food. This food has no business being this delicious. Okay, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get Kachi Don. Yeah. I'm gonna get 
at least one. Plane ticket. Awesome. Okay, so literally sumo wrestling in the middle of a. Uh... See, here's the thing. Here's the thing that I don't I don't like about this. Right, the tables are like right next to the arena. So if someone were to like push somebody off, they'd land right on the fucking tables. So, I'm okay with this. This is a great idea. But I would think that the tables literally need to be pushed up against here. So people could enjoy the fight and still, you know, be able to enjoy their meals. Not only, I mean, when you really think about it, not only are the customers uh, in danger of a sumo wrestler falling into their hot meals, but the sumo wrestler now has to worry about falling. Look at that. Look at that bucket. Look at that bucket of, of delicious food, right? It's steaming. That is scalding hot. I don't think it's fair to the sumo wrestler to have an added risk of literally falling on scalding hot soup. But that's just me. Anyway, uh, let's press triangle. Uh, let's go in the messages. And then go to the images. Um, and then go to... What are we going to? Um, hmm. Missions. Tracking the mystery code. Okay. Input the numbers from the posters. Press triangle in the messages app. Okay. Okay. Um. Enter pass code. Let me go to missions. I don't remember what it is. Damn it. Uh.
Okay. Five one. Nope. Entering a passcode. I'm sorry, guys. There's only one way I'm going to be able to do this. Okay. All right, there you go. Asterisk added to your contacts. Other. Who is this? All right. Bosch? No, something's off. I told Bosch to get in touch with me at this number. Who is this? A friend of Bosch? Well, you're wondering, and you're wondering where he is. Hmm. As an information broker, I'll tell you whatever it is you need to know for a price. But considering the client relationship here, cash doesn't seem like an appropriate form of payment. How about you collect some intel for me instead? I want to know about a specific fighter. Seems this was taken at the construction site somewhere in Metro City. Find him for me. Do that, and I'll share everything I know with you. Okay. Clear. The former elusive national champ. Okay, so where are we going? All the way back there. I'm going to take this main street. Yep. I'm going to do some running. We're a Karataka. We don't need a train. You got business here. There we go. Ah, <laughs> uh, let's Hi. talk to them both. If you went in, I'm gonna have to see a safety helmet on that dome. Your first timer here, right? Newbies. Wear yellow ones. Rules are rules. The new hires wear the yellow helmets. Those are the rules around here. You got it? If you don't have one, I'm sure there's a store selling them somewhere. Hmm. Pretty sure a shop by the stadium sells them. You know the one I'm talking about, right? The funky truck? No, no, none of that. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold your horses, buddy. Safety first. If you want in here, you better be wearing a yellow safety helmet. I had to tell off another worker earlier. They're probably moping around nearby. I've got to wonder what could possibly cause a construction worker to forget their helmet. Dick. Dicks. Alright. So. Now I have to walk all the way back to the damn stadium. Alright.
Just going in between cars, don't mind me. Seems fucking stupid. I guess equipped it now. Fucking Ugg boots. to change color we could go almost lunatics colors but I like red and white, so we're gonna do that. Go back. <laughs> Run out in the middle of the street. Eventually, I'll change the whole outfit to red, but... Hey there. Well, looky here, someone's got themselves a helmet. Make sure it's on your head, then talk to my pal next to me. Ah. Oh, you've got a helmet. How did I not see that? Proceed with safety.
I'm definitely getting Ken as a sensei. I'm just saying. Hey. I haven't seen you around here before, new hire. Hate to break it to you, but this area is for skilled workers only. No entry for little construction chickadees, you see? If you're looking to prove what you've got what it takes, well, you know what to do. All right. Jesus Christ. Let me see. That the best you can do? Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. what I get for trying to perfect the move. Nicely done. You seem real to really know your stuff, newbie. With skills like those, I bet you could hang with the night shift. That's a test of skill we run here at night. There yeah, okay. If you're interested, feel free to stop by. Tracked him down, huh? That's all right. Ken Masters. Okay, I'm just gonna wait till he's done. That's all right. That's him, all right. Ken Masters. And location is the construction site at the CERN building. Never expected a fame fighter like him to be slinking around in a place like this. This is some juicy stuff right here. Thanks. I'll keep my end of the bargain, of course, and message you about Bosch shortly. Real quick, though, think you could think you might be interested in doing more intel gathering? Plenty of clients out there looking for intel on fighters. For starters, I'm starved for up-to-date info on fighters from Japan. I hear there's a sumo-themed restaurant in Metro City's west side. A good place to start is any, I imagine. I'm not asking you to do this for free, of course. I'll do more digging into Bosch's situation for one. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. Now go ahead and get scratching. Alright. Items. I am definitely taking Ken up as a master. You new here? Moved like lightning back there when it all went pear shaped with the crane. Color me impressed. Didn't even get any thought to po the possibility of being flattened like a pancake, huh? Ah. Well, great minds think alike. Move first, think later. So long as you keep moving, things will work themselves out in the end. Or so I thought, anyway. 
Uh, I'm just rambling. Forget it. And then... Anyway, what you need. I want to become your student. You want to become my student. <sighs> Listen, when it comes to the construction yard, I barely know my hand from a hammer. If you want to learn the ins and outs, you'll have to ask someone else. What I mean is I want to, you to teach me how to fight. You want me to teach you martial arts. You know who I am, huh? A national martial arts champion. A former champion. Um... As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm currently a humble construction worker. Don't exactly have room in the old schedule for teaching. Mm. But if you're not going to listen to reason, I have to see you out of here. I'll just have to see you out of here myself. So you want to do this the easy way or the hard way? Never give up, never surrender. Oh, man. man alive. Okay, Al. He is countering me. That's annoying. Fuck. That's right. Round two. Fuck! Jesus Christ. say no to that enthusiasm and even if I did it looks like you're just gonna keep coming by and trashing the place until I don't <sighs> I'm having flashbacks of the of a past due to mine it was fiery as all get out, throwing himself at every anything, yeah, everything he could with reckless abandon. Not unlike you. You became Ken's student. You can now use his fighting style, basic moves, and unique attacks. Uh, also, you also learned his master action. Three can. Okay. Tots. 
Sanaki Senpukyaku. All right. Awesome. All right, let's see what his stance looks like. I'm about to get off here, guys. I only wanted to, like, really play for an hour. So, Ken uses a sideways fighting stance. Where... Luke is a little bit more rounded. Marissa just straight almost squares off. That's Nihachi. He's using a sideways stance. Let me get this fucking helmet off my head. Thank you. I'm gonna try Ken's style. A little bit. Now we're going to go into skills for a second. Alright, increase max capacity of your gauge. By one. Alright, it's cheaper to do that. Increase drive gauge regeneration speed while outside of battle. We're going to do that. All right. All right, profile. Former US National Fighting Champion and ex-VP of Masters Foundations. Accusations of orchestrating a criminal plot have forced Ken to abandon his family and business and go into hiding. Fighting style. Ensetsuken based martial arts. Beginner friendly style developed through tournament experience and experimentation, defined by a fiery rush down style. Alright. Alright, guys, that's where I'm going to call it quits for today. If you guys haven't already checked out Lunatics Landing, uh, website, Teespring store, or our Discord. The links are in the About Me section of my Twitch channel. And thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful night.